hey my friend Jean-Serge Gagnon here so today we're going to talk about creating a course a course online how do you create a course what's the best way to create your first course online where can you host it and what is well yeah what's the best way right I mean there's a lot of ways a lot of places you can go obviously I have my preferences so whatever my preferences are doesn't necessarily mean you have to follow those but I'm going to talk about the way you can come up with a course idea the way you can uh, create it and host it and show people about it and get people interested in it we're going to talk about all these different things in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets so you might have heard a lot about this I mean this is course income secrets after all so there are some things that I talk about that seemingly aren't about creating courses but the thing is you have to remember a course online is basically an educational series where you teach something so and that's that's just one part right and putting together the course and teaching it uh, is is just one part there's just creating it is not going to get you income right it's not going to generate you income by just creating it creating a course is the an infinitesimal part of creating income the income comes from people buying your course people will buy your course if they know like and trust you people will know like and trust you if they're around you if they either uh, already know you or if you're putting content in front of them that makes them know like and trust you that's called, called personal branding and how do you get people to come to you well that's attraction marketing how do you get attraction mar I mean there's so much stuff but today we're going back to the basics on just the course creation so for, let first let me share my screen and before I share my screen let me tell you if you're listening to the audio of this you really want to go check out the video and the blog post you're going to go find that at cis318.jsgagnon.com to go check out the blog and the video because uh like I said I'm going to share my screen show you platforms show you things like that so let's just go over here and let's just get the screen sharing going all right here nope wrong one wrong one this one here nope this one this one this one oh look at that okay so hold on I gotta close this window I'm sure that my computer is uh, gonna slow down let's just get into that uh sorry about that I guess my okay yeah, new, new new window all right so let's wow this is <laughs> I got way too much stuff going on on my computer right I don't know about you but whoops what happened there it just closed off it's giving me the most trouble it really likes to give me trouble that's just how it is let's go back to the desktop there we go let's get that out of there whoops there we go okay so um okay so the first thing you want to do is you want to create a course right so say you don't you, you already have an idea then great right that's great but if you don't have an idea just start thinking about things that you know things that you're good at things that you've you've known for sort of long time things that you've been you know you've been even talking to people about it what is it that you like to talk to people about that can be your course and if it's something that you're learning you've been learning recently they do talk about invest learn teach right so if you want to teach something that you're learning right now you can actually do that um, I'm sure you've heard the saying all you got to do is be one chapter one chapter ahead of your students right if you're one chapter ahead of your students you can teach them that topic they don't need to know that you don't know anything about chapter two and three and four and five as long as you know about chapter one which is the chapter you just read yesterday you can teach that so the secret is finding a topic that people are interested in or finding an audience and then finding something they're interested in or finding something and then finding the audience that's interested in that it's all about finding people that are interested in your topic now you can you could just create a course right you could just create a course 
you know how to google things how to search for things online <laughs> what's the best way to search right what are the the best phrases you can use how do you how to find plugins to use in your google searches you, you there's you can teach anything literally anything and the secret of course to generating income from those courses is making them valuable making them valuable to people so what how do you how do you know how much your course is worth or how you can how much you can sell it well there's a couple of things first of all people will there's always going to be people who are going to be willing to pay a premium for something even though that same education is available for free right <laughs> if you have a better way um or if you can prove that your um your way of teaching it or the the platform or anything you're using or whatever it is 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 going to give them some results those people will buy it right so you got it but you know how do you find those people right so anyways that's that's a separate issue but let's talk about creating your first course let's actually you know what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go in here and I'm going to go into my uh into my folder here I'm going to just create a little text file new text document and it's going to just be notes let's open it up so what do you need to do when you start right so first of all number one is you need to choose a topic or you need to choose an audience whoops an audience or a a niche I guess I should say probably choose a niche choose a niche okay so you can either choose a topic or a niche depending on how you want to approach it but both of those two things that have to be chosen in the beginning right if you don't if you don't choose a niche like okay what, what do I mean by niche right a niche is um um uh, online making money online it's uh it's it, well actually there's there's four three or four categ main categories of health wealth um relationships and income or gen wealth uh, not wealth but I mean well I guess those are the three they're really those are the three health wealth and and, and relationships those are the three things and then in wealth wealth which was number two here in wealth there's online wealth there's real estate there's uh there's investing there's cryptocurrency there's all these different things right so those are those are niches right the the three I, I forget what they call those three those three top threes right um some say there's a fourth making money from home right but it's really part of the wealth I guess so it's so but anyways you choose a niche which is and then of course if you want to be really successful the next thing is coming up with your own blue ocean <laughs> I'm getting way ahead there's so much stuff let's just let's just focus on creating your course right so let's forget let's forget about the niche the audience the, all these things even though they're super important to if that'll affect whether you get results or not but let's just assume that you're going to do it the right way but you want a course you want to create a course so choose a topic choose a niche and then of course choose choose what you'll teach right so what is it that you're going to teach are you going to talk about like I said doing google searches you're going to talk about growing your Facebook audience are you going to talk about creating a, a, a business from a plugin are you going to talk about um LinkedIn are you going to talk about uh, attraction marketing personal branding uh, doing ads on Facebook doing ads on YouTube YouTube videos getting subscribers I mean there's so much you can talk about right gardening crochet crocheting uh, uh, being a being a good uh, uh have uh, you know keeping your pets happy um keep you know par positive parenting you know that that's that there's so much stuff you can talk about it doesn't really matter but the idea is you got to choose a topic you're going to teach and what so what results will you get your audience right what results are you going to get your audience so your results that you want your audience to get you know it's it's they're going to have this course they're going to go through right what are they going to get out of it right it, it's it could be um you know um income it could be um a b better garden it could be uh better searches online it could be uh, more 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 engagement on their Facebook it could be ads that give you re get results it could be 
you know whatever it is what is it that you're gonna get your audience what is the result you're gonna get from that result we we talk about um uh, what the actual benefit is right but we're not going to get into that right now but you've got to at least know what is it that you're going to go so because the reason why you need to know that is because you're going to be you know teaching your course and you're going to split it up into a certain number of of of, of uh, sections right so one of the things that uh, one of my mentors teaches Russell Brunson he talks about putting together three versions or even four maybe of your course okay of what you're teaching what is it that you're teaching three different ways so the first way is a short form or just a a quick document maybe bullet list of what it is with some little tips on how to accomplish that on their own that they will want uh and they will be willing to well you're going to give away for free right or for very very low price and they will they will want to, and they'll give you their email address and you'll get them on your list and all this stuff so so there's okay so let's just say that so five is um uh, plan your three versions okay so your three versions is going to be number one so version a is a short document or video whatever format you want to make it right um that details the steps to accomplish accomplish result whoops accomplish results without getting into details of how whoops of how to accomplish 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 it okay so that's that's just a document like for example um say that you are doing a course on on doing better google searches well you're going to talk about that you need to go to google.com right that you look at the the form you can say whatever words you type there just maybe don't include the or remove some words or 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 how to properly formulate your your search you're going to say you know that's pretty basic and and then you there's plugins you can install that'll help you to find a relevant searches that that are similar to the ones you just searched for don't forget make sure you don't look at the ads or the ads are good but you realize that they're ads so you might want to scroll down to look at the actual results from the engine and those kinds of things maybe go on page two or three to see more of the results and you talk about that a little bit but without you know showing them how to do it you just kind of say a little bit about it right and you give that away as a free b now obviously doing a google search is not a good example but it's just kind of give you an idea right so b will be a uh, five to six hour training with you know five to ten videos on each step right so you're going to do that's going to be that's going to be the actual course that's going to be the, the 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 course that's going to be the main part right so this this should be free this should be free or or less than ten dollars okay this one should be uh should be so probably at least a hundred dollars but I'm I would just suggest so let's say three to one thousand okay depending on the topic depending on how much uh, either you're because the thing is that the more you sell it for right the the more elite people you're going to get in right plus it's going to encourage you to do a better job if you're selling it for more right and then c the third version would be whoops the third version would be a ma a, a live master class with students over a let's say five to well ten week period right so one to two hour each session right so this could be you know two thousand to five thousand so now there's 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 things to talk about how do you do that so how do you so first of all okay so that's your plan right that's kind of your plan you got these three versions you're going to be putting it together so how do you come up with that the first thing you got to realize is that whatever topic you want to teach you know it well that the whole point is you know it well 
or you've learned it really well you've put, taken action or you know other people that got results or whatever it is right and so that becomes how do you how do you put this into action okay so now you got your three your three ideas so let's just how do you get started so number six get get okay so first number six is you you could you could actually you know record those those five to six uh, hours of training with these five to ten videos and put them in a platform and start selling right but the thing with that is there's there's lots of problems with that one of them is you don't really know if your audience is going to be interested in that exactly what you're thinking maybe they will but maybe they won't maybe they maybe they want a different approach maybe they want to learn another thing before the other thing maybe they're more interested in 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 this other aspect or this other tool that you didn't even think about maybe they've they've heard about other people teaching this and they're they they're they're kind of no, you know whatever there's a whole bunch of reasons why maybe the way and the content might be different so here's what you do the next thing you do is you do is you create the course skeleton you could you could do that in uh click ecourse so let's just show you how to do that in click ecourse so you go to click ecourse.com click ecourse.com let me just put that link on here uh click ecourse where's click ecourse I have it here I'm sure there you go so you go to click ecourse.com um and you register an account so this right now I'm already logged in so let's just actually go and open up a incognito window and go to the site so you can kind of see what it looks like so when you first go to click ecourse.com you're going to see this basic uh welcome right and you can just click on the register at the top here and all you got to do is is uh let's put that there like this I didn't realize that you could see the background let's fix that there we go so you just go here you can click on continue with Facebook in a second it'll show up I just my computer just slow but normally you'll have a button there that there you go continue with Facebook where it'll uh, allow you to just uh, you know register with using your Facebook email and all that um otherwise you can click on use email and password and you cr create an account once you have an account you can actually host up to two courses for free if you want more there's plans and all that but we're not going to really get into that right now I just want to show you how to create a course so when you're on the clicky course after you've registered you're going to see the news feed like this right and uh, you just go to the big plus the big plus the green plus right there and you just say course I want to create a new course you click on that it loads up a new course now why do you why do you want to have that you want to have you want to be able to send people to the page where your course will be even I'm not saying to, you're not creating the course the content of the lessons you're just creating the skeleton so in this skeleton you're going to say my super course right you're going to say it this you're going to say this course is about the most amazing thing ever right and then in the details you can say you will learn all, all learn all about blah 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 right whatever you click on next over here and uh, well actually you don't need to click on that so you can click right on all these different tabs up here right downloadable price commission cover image you can click on all these things or you can click on the done when you're done over here in the cover image you choose a cover image if you don't choose a file it'll be just a little c there we'll just do that for now I just click on done oh oh before no actually what we want to do you click on edit course again if you want to re go back to that screen um over here you're actually going to want to have a price on your course you want to make sure your course has a price even though there's no content yet so let's make the course uh, a price of let's make it two thousand dollars right two thousand um, dollars you can also decide to give people a commission if they re if they refer it or you just put this at zero if you don't but I typically give 50 to even 90 percent commission to people that refer because I'm looking for people to grow in my audience I'm not necessarily looking for income from a from a course but let's just say you want to give 50 percent commission right you just say that click on done right here all right so now this see this course is two thousand dollars you must add a, at least one lesson or module because before you can publish this course so 
since we don't have any videos yet what we could do is we just add one lesson so how do you do that you go to the lesson you click on the plus right here whoops right over here and you just add a new lesson this will be lesson number um well lesson one by default but you can make it different numbers I'm going to say first first uh so introduction introduction right so learn what this course is about whatever right and then details is mm, I will explain what this course course is about and I want this particular lesson to be a lesson that is um what what am I trying to say here I want this to be a free access lesson so yes I want to make it free access right here I just click on the yes right there and by the way uh you can put a YouTube link right here to get a video from YouTube which is well you that's the only option you have when you have the free account but so so you would upload the video to YouTube and then put it here right now we don't even have one so I'm just going to click on save like this with no video if I go back to the course by clicking the course link here I'm on the site now I have my less my course if you want to edit this image you want to change the thumbnail there just click on the edit course and go to the thumbnail tab and change it same thing with the lesson there's no video here it just says L like that because it's a blank lesson with nothing but at least now it's a course that you can actually send people to so you first have to publish the course make it available so you can either make it as a public course which I wouldn't recommend in the beginning you or just make it an unlisted course so you just go back again to edit the course and you go to the access tab right up here access right there and you click on that and you just change the access to um, unlisted so at least by making it unlisted now you can send people to the page so they can see what it is so you just click on unlisted there and you say done now the course is unlisted which means that if you take the link that's up here oh I forgot about that didn't I I'll just put that over here if you take the link let's see the link that's right there right this link that's up there that's in your browser if you take that link here let's just make the browser again I forgot to resize it to the right screen side okay if you take that if you take that link that's there um I should probably I probably should add a share button or something on here right or a link to course or something so I can right click and copy it right anyways um actually if you click on your link that's true that's right if you click on once you've got a registered you can click on your link which will give you your link to the course you can share that um let's see if I click on it it gives me here's your link to the share this is going to be 75 percent commission for this course because I that's what I put in the in the saving I copy the clipboard copy the clipboard now it's in my clipboard I can go to send that to people I can just go to paste and go to the course and you'll see what it looks like which really obviously doesn't look good <laughs> right it says just my super course whatever there's no lessons oh I forgot about, there's one thing I forgot here in the lessons you actually have to publish the lesson if you don't publish the lesson you won't be able to see it so if I publish it now if I reload this page it'll show me there's one lesson there's one lesson right here and this would normally be a video that you could play right now there's no video so there's no there's no um, uh, and actually this should be a public I think it doesn't do with if there's no yeah even though I have it on free access right here it's not showing up as as visible because there's no video right if I go back to this and I add a let's say I add a YouTube video to it doesn't really matter let's just put uh these are longer videos let's do a short one let's do a short one let's search for um, 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 um let's search for LinkedIn just for for fun LinkedIn LinkedIn show all short little LinkedIn I just want to do a short little one a short LinkedIn video so just go through my page here look at that there's a 10 minute video I'm just going to copy this get shareable link I'm going to paste that in here enter link put that link and save it so that'll download the video from YouTube or at least make it available in the course and the normal way all oh right that you know, don't normally have these video links sorry that's for the advanced account but if I go to the course 
and I edit this course I'll make it the same as what it was if it was a free course uh, in the free course you in the free account you don't get uh embedded player it's embedded videos yes downloadable that's not an option in it's not possible in the free court in the free account but anyways that's kind of so the course looks like this if I go back to here now and I reload the page now I have I'm going to have a course right there right with the video so it's not supposed to say by now oh that's because I'm not logged in so I have to be able to view this I have to be logged in and but in the, oh that's because it's not a free course yes that's why but so somebody can watch this if they have an account on your account they can watch the introduction you can kind of show them what this is about so that's okay so that's the basics of creating your course skeleton so let's go back to the notes so we talked about creating the course skeleton is there there's only one L right course skeleton on click eCourse so that's kind of how you do it so the next thing is number seven is you want to invite people to the course um master class so you now you could like I said you could record it but the problem is that if you do that maybe they're not even going to be and maybe it's not even going to be right so the best way for you to do it is you invite people to the master class so you schedule uh obviously you have to schedule a master class you got to decide okay it's going to be every 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 Sunday every Friday every Tuesday afternoon every Tuesday evening whatever you decide you set a block of time a one hour block maybe probably two hours to teach that particular thing so you got to split your course into what you think the the course is going to be about into those sessions and you create this master class recording right so then what you're going to do is you're going to make that available to people for free or a low price right see how it's going to be so the master class would be two to five thousand right but because you haven't done the course yet and you don't have any social proof you don't have anybody saying hey you know this guy helped me with this they did this whatever then you need to have the the you need to be able to give that information to get to get testimony get people get social proof get people to say hey that really worked that really helped me so you need those things to be able to put them in the course sales page or course funnel or those kinds of things so you record that and over the next you know month or two months you're going to end up with the recording right you ended up with that so that's kind of what that that is and you know after you've uh, decided on your master obviously part of your master class is you got to decide where you're going to host it one of the best places is in Facebook groups or soon to be in click eCourse groups as well but you got to have a place where people can congregate can connect together can can exchange ideas so a group is the best place for that right social groups Facebook LinkedIn um cl uh, clicky course groups those kinds of places where you can have groups of people together that connect um once you have the master class you're going to be recording those sessions and you could potentially put those as your five to six hour training with the five to ten videos you know be here you could create it from those recordings depending on how well it turns out that is the goal is to try to do that so that's how you end up with your course so after you've done your master class and you've got your short document to get people into the master class right so first you're going to give this away you're going to send emails to people saying hey I've got this master class starting on whatever day would you like to join in it's normally going to be two thousand or it's going to be three thousand or five thousand whatever it is but you can get it for free or 50 bucks or 100 bucks or whatever you choose to do the cool thing about click eCourse is you can actually have a coupon for this this could be your master class this could be the course you could have a separate one for your master class where you maybe you put the price at five thousand and then you create a deal you say I want to I want a coupon coupon one two three right that's going to be you know 150 bucks right and there's like 20 of them maximum of 20 people you, you do this now you've got a coup a course you can have oops sorry I should have then you have a, a a coupon you can cop you can send people which if they go to this course with that coupon a code or they the link you send them they'll see that your course is 150 bucks for them 
even though it's 2000 they get it for 150 bucks because of the coupon that you sent them so you can do that kind of stuff right so those those are the kinds of things you can do with a hosting site that has coupons and deals and those kinds of things but that's the idea you create this this master plan if you will on how to create your course put the skeleton together set up a master class have the master class teach the people encourage them to ask you questions throughout the the sessions and then you'll end up with your course that you can host all right hopefully you uh can you got some value from this and if you're interested in learning more you can always reach out you can always connect connect with me have conversations um uh, you know just come ahead come along to to the journey of course income secrets you can actually find course income secrets at courseincomesecrets.com you can register to to not not miss anything you can go to my blog as well or like I said you can go to the this particular episode on my blog all right have yourself a great day and we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Ooh. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon, until next time.